Yes, you're talking with uh, Villas uh, from Aarhus, and I'm doing a deck tech of uh, Arabian Zoo. That uh, that is a deck I'm uh, very excited to um, to show you today, and it makes specifically uh, good sense when the when the sit in a bottle is restricted to bring this deck to the tables because it does play four of Kurt Apes, which is a very efficient creature for its mana cost. Um, it does also play for Surrender Ifrit. I have chosen to play a, a Surrender Jin, which is a very powerful creature in the air, um, and also from the Arabian set. And last but not least, uh, of the creatures I've chosen to play the Urnum Jin. So, as you can see, it's all from the Arabian Knight set. Um, and this is a deck that's not been. Um, played much lately uh, due to, to City of Ball is basically everywhere. Uh, so the restriction does uh, give this deck a, a fair chance to, uh, to play, uh, to play very well actually as well, because the creatures from Arabian Night is just very powerful. It does play for Lightning Ball. Obviously it's a very, very good removal and direct damage. Uh, and is still played in many of the newer formats as well. It does also play two Chain Lightning. It does also play two Sonic Blast. I have chosen to play this a bit slightly worse mana efficient than Chain Lightning, but it does kill Sarah Angels, opponents, Ifrits, and it does hit for four. So it is a very powerful quarter card as well. I do play three of Crumble. Many surprised I'm not chosen the Shatter, um, but I have chosen to play the Crumble due to its mana efficiency. One mana is much better than two, and um, when you kill Moxus and Fit uh, Mistress Factory, that life doesn't matter at all. Um, but of course, if you want to be kill a Suchi and stuff like that, it does it as good almost, but they will gain some life. So, um, so in that matter, and later on, the shadow will would be a better option. I do play the three blue powers, access to recall, the time twister, and the time walk. If you have these cards and you do play blue, they will be included in your deck. If you want to do, if you want to play the best version at least. Um, it does also play the Wheel of Fortune, and if you play red, this one should be in your deck as well, and a specific a fast deck like this, draw seven effects are just a very, very powerful way to, to attack the game. It does also play three counter spells, so it's not all in, all the way. It's a bit more controlled in some lists, but um, I have chosen three counter spells and one mana drain to answer, for example, the one of sitting a ball if it finds a way into the main, but also source to plowshares, other power cards that can interrupt with your game plans. Um, so I've chosen, I've chosen four four counter spells as well to uh, to smooth out the game a bit. I have two silver libraries in the main and one regrowth, which I've all, all three very, very powerful green cards you have. Um, so, of course, they also in the deck. I do only play the, the uncolor Moxes. So I play an Emerald, a Ruby, and a Sapphire. I do not play the Black Splash, um, which you see a lot in old school for the Mind Twist and the Demonic Tutor. I have chosen not to, to play that. Um, Due to the strict mana of this deck, basically you have double blue in the counter spell, but you also have the Kurt Ape that require um, green and red. Um, so when you're deep in all three colors, I don't find um, the splash worth it, basically. And and hence also not the, the splash moxes. So, um, but I do play the, the Black Lotus, play a Soul Ring, and probably the best removal in the game. If you can 
hit at least. It's the chaos so, um, And for the mana, I play the the one off strip mine. I play two two islands. I do play three tropical islands. Four volcanic islands. Uh, two city of brasses. The Library of Alexandria, another very, very powerful card from the Arabian Nights set. I do play three tigers. And last but not least, I do play four Mistress Factory, which is another great way to, to keep the attack up when they have balanced or done other horrible things to your creatures. So that's the main deck. In the sideboard, I do play two Control Magic. I have chosen Control Magic due to not have access to plowshares, basically. Um, because when the creatures are with too big toughness, my my kill a lightning bolts and a blast can't kill them. For example, the Juice and Jin or the Surrender Jin. Or an Urnum, for example. And I expect in this tournament that there, there, there will be some of these, even though they're, they're Raby Knights. Um, so it makes really good sense when that bottle is restricted. So two, uh, so two of these, of course. I do play two Whirlwind Dervis. Particularly good when the opponent play the Abyss. Three Red Elemental Blast to fight power. Counter spells. Kill the freaks. It does do everything for one red mana. That's uh, that's a very very powerful card. Of course, three of them in the sideboard as well. I do play one shatter. Artifact are very good in old school, and you need to have a lot to deal with them if you want to 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 keep up with the with all the suits and books and Triskillian stuff like that. And and hence that's why I also play the two energy flocks. I do play two blue elemental bars, and that's specifically to to Blood Moon, which is a lights out basically for this deck, uh, but um, also for all the great red cards you find in the format. I do play artifact blasts. Sin bottle is a, even though it's a one off, it's still expected for me to be in in every deck basically. And um, if you can stop that card from ever resolving, you are in good hands. If it resolves, it's a slightly worse. Um, so um, yeah, Artifact Blast, also very good at taking out Moxus on the stack or Triskillian, Suchis, you name it. Really powerful card as well. One Stone Ring, I don't like Mace of It, and, uh, and I want an answer for that, um, even though I only have one, it's still there. I have a Tranquility to kill Abyss, Moat, stuff like that. Uh, I don't have any uh, good way to kill enchantments. So uh, Tranquility, of course, is in this sideboard as well. But uh, thank you very much for, for listening. This is, uh, this is uh, Arabian Zoo, and uh, I look forward to, to play against you on Saturday.